So I have Tristan in here again today. Now this will be the third time that I've worked with him. Um, the last time I brought him in, I worked on picking up his feet a little bit, just his front feet. Uh, but today I am going to lead him out of this pen and into the round pen there. Somebody was asking why I'll start off with the babies in here. Um, I have a lot of horses I have to work here, so it's a lot easier for me to get them in here and it takes a lot less time than just trying to get them to approach me. I use this as a tool to help me get my job done more efficiently. Now that's already a huge change from the first time. Instead of him blowing out there, it actually took him a minute to come out. But now that he's out here with me, I'm gonna just give him a minute to kind of remember what is going on. And a lot of the times with these babies, they have a real hard time leading out of here. And I'm sure I could do some things to make it a little easier, like move these panels around so that they're not coming out right on this pole. But I still want them to get used to this. Now there is something that I do when it comes to this. I just wanna get their attention on me. If the horse wants to go backwards though, I'm gonna make that kind of my idea and I'm gonna ask them to go back quite a bit. So I'll just start off by asking him to lead over here. Now right there, if he wants to go backwards, I'm gonna stick with him and make him back up a little bit more than he would have wanted to. And that will go a long way by just making that kind of your idea. I'll ask him to take a step. I'll make it nice and loose again. Here, I'll give him plenty of time to kind of think about it in between me asking him. Just see if I could help him out a little bit. And when he does make that attempt, I'll give him a big break. Put a nice sway in that lead rope. Good job, buddy. Let me give him some encouragement real quick since he made it out of there. That was a big ordeal for him. I know there's a lot of spooky stuff out here, but you'll be just fine. He's eyeballing the trash can right now. And these are all things that he has to get used to in life. And come on in. Good job. Now that we got him in here, I'm gonna give him a minute to relax. I'm just gonna leave this nice long lead rope on him. Um, there's not really a big chance of him getting tangled up. There's no knots in that. There's nothing on here in the round pen here he can get this caught on. So I'm just gonna leave him here for a couple minutes just to get used to his surroundings in the round pen. 